Yes, family, we are on a beautiful walking tour of Confo Anoche Teaching Hospital. A Kubi nice shirt, perfect. <laughs> Thanks uh, for wearing it. That's all right. Thanks for my black shirt. And I want red. I'm going to do I want black. I want red. <laughs> that's all right. In due time, you get all them for me. In due time, I'll get all them for you? Absolutely. Especially if you're part of the marketing team. The you can have, I'm going to create a new red, red one uh, this year. Okay. And create another a new green one. And black too. That's my favorite color. You know that. So. What should you got? You talking and stuff. The folks are making people mad with me. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm gonna man? keep talking. You know, some of the ones that's not interesting, but I'm still gonna talk. I'm oh, because you, you share information? Mm -hmm. I'm still gonna get people to come. I'm still gonna tell and ask people, family members, non family, co colleague. And I got David doing the same thing. We're gonna, we're gonna encourage them. Yes, we have to. You've been in the dark too long. Yes, y'all, you're walking fast. Come on, come on through, come on through. Family, we are walking to the sword site. <laughs> oh boy. Are you taking us the long way or the short way? I'm going to turn around and go to Bowie. Turn myself right around. Family, this is a very huge place. Lots of buildings. Now we're taking you through all aspects of the country. And now we're at a teaching hospital. It's just still a regular hospital. I'm trying to remember how we got to the sword site last time. Alright, so family, this is just a brief view. Kamasi, the land of royals. That's the that was original hospital. Uh -huh. That's the original. What's the the rest are all addition. That was the original. That's the original building. You know, like the children always say, are we there yet? <laughs> how, or how far? And family, we're also in the land of the Adinkra. Just like our Nana shirt right here, family, all these Adinkra symbols. Unique culture, family. You come to Ghana, you must come to Kumasi and visit these sites we're showing you. Because that's how you're going to get all of the roots and culture. And then family, once we finish here, we're going to take you to the Arts and Culture Center in Kumasi. And inside there, there's a Prempe the Second Museum. You've heard the legacy, you've heard all kind of information about the man himself, and that is his museum dedicated to his history and his work. <laughs> yes, I'm just, you know. We got, let me hold the sunglasses for you. Oh, that way, that way, perfect. Oh, that's in the way. That's in the way of the mountain. Okay. Oh, yes, it is. Night nurse. Great rising. Night nurse. Yeah. Okay. Okay, the ambulance is ready for me, right? 
Yeah. No, you still got a good 30, 40 good years. Okay. Well, not, hey, seven, that now, years. This section of the women hospital is dedicated to the late uh, Queen Mother of Asante. That's the name, Nana Ithia Kobisawa. So that is, and it, she is the mother of the current king of Asante. So I said the women hospital because it's all related to maternity and all that. That's the section. Yes. in here. The people you see sitting down are, are all waiting. Their relatives are here mm -hmm. and therefore they don't want to go home. They're sitting and waiting to hear information from the doctors or the nurses and if maybe they need some medicine and uh, it's not readily available at the pharmacy, they take the prescriptions and then they go out to the pharmacy uh, to buy them and bring them. So they are here 24 hours depending on how long their relative is here. And family, we are finally here. So that was a um, short walk. Watch, watch. Yes. Okay. We are almost at the salt site where Confanoche planted the salt and it is said that over hundreds of years, no. Excuse me, what is going on over here? Um, I'm quiet. I'm quiet. I'm quiet. Here, nobody is able. To, to remove this sword, and people have tried, notable people who have tried, is Comfort, uh, is, is Muhammad Ali, who has, <laughs> who has tried to, people have tried, and they've not been able to remove it. <laughs> they've not been able to remove the sword. Now, it is also, the family, uh, excuse um, the family. Uh, we just had a we it? just had a crazy person a little while ago, but he's, he's gone. That's why we laughing. But continue, my brother. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Now this sword is also a symbolism of Asante unity. It's a symbolism of Asante unity because the planter, the famous Okonfanoche, says that the day anyone will be able to remove this sword, that will be the end of the Asante nation, of the Asante empire. So we're going there. I'm going to hand you over to the side guy who is going to tell us more about the sword. But it is also believed that this is where Confanduta gather all the chiefs of Asante and bringing their stools and then uh, conjuring the golden stool, the golden stool and fall on the lap of the king of Saitutu who founded the British Empire. So, let's go in and let's... Here it is, family, the sword site. Yeah, that was a nice little, nice little walk. <laughs> Got a chance to actually walk around the hospitals and see some of the main buildings. And family, we have arrived from the statue to the actual sword site. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 